that is exclusive to my off night podcast listeners. Um, so make sure you take care of our sponsors. We got one topic to get into today. One, and that's it. Again, we are live. We are live from the W. What is it? The WXPN podcast studio, uh, live and direct. One podcast. One 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 topic to get into today. Um, let me get my notes in front of me. Um, we got one thing to get into today. Uh, and then we can get into a full off night podcast. I mean, off night radio episode later on in the week because I know I didn't get y'all one last week. So uh, we can get to a whole 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 another episode another time. Which I know we got to get into. We got to get into your guy, Aaron Rodgers, man. Aaron Rodgers is in full diva mode. You hear what I said? Aaron Rodgers is in full diva mode. Now, let me put my full disclaimer out there. Or let me get full disclosure out there. Let me make sure I get everything right. Aaron Rodgers is definitely still top five quarterback in the NFL right now. For sure. Aaron Rodgers is definitely, uh, you know, he should have some say into, you know, what players come on to, you know, what players they get on the team um, what players they acquire, what players they end up drafting. Okay, fair enough. But Aaron Rodgers is in full demo mode. Let me get this straight, Aaron. Are you mad with the Packers because they drafted Jordan Love? Or are you mad because they haven't renewed your contract? Because you want, because you see what Dak Prescott got and you want to have more uh, money per year than what he got and what Patrick Mahomes got as well. Are you mad because of that? Or are you mad because you don't got no receivers? Cause I, I can't keep up with I can't keep up. This is all this is some diva stuff right here. Then oh, and you said you were mad about not being able. You wanted the GM fired. So you want the GM fired. You got mad that they they drafted Jordan Love. You want a contract extension. You just got uh uh your, your, the guarantee money is out. Just you got damn near a hundred million dollars guaranteed. You want another. You want some more money. You got three years left on your contract. Um, you want the GM fired. You want more receivers, even though you got Devontae Adams, who is a top five wide receiver in the NFL right now, right? You got Scantley, who's a hell of a wide receiver as well, right now. So what is it? It just feels like you're just complaining just to complain. Are you just sick of being in Green Bay? Is that it? It can't be Matt, uh, it can't be Matt LaFleur. He just got there. Because remember, it was Mike McCarthy a couple years ago. Remember, everything was Mike McCarthy's fault? And got, they got him out of there. You got a new coach. I like this guy, Matt LaFleur. He should let you go for it on fourth down, but it is what it is. You had plenty of positions, plenty of possessions in that game to um, you know, to 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 get the lead and possibly win that game. I don't like the fact that people keep saying that the game came down to that play. I don't like that. But it is what it is. So now, now the GM gotta go. You got Mike McCarthy out there. That's the guy you won the Super Bowl with. You got to get Mike McCarthy out there. Okay, cool, he's gone. You got Matt, you got Devontae Adams, top five wide receiver. So let me get this straight. You want to get traded. You want to go because you think gra- the grass is green on the other side. Here's the list of teams. Look, I'm going to give you a list of teams that, that can possibly trade for uh, uh, Aaron Rodgers. We got the Denver Broncos. We got the Oakland Raiders. We got the Miami Dolphins. We got Washington's football team. They still don't have a name. Oh, my goodness. And uh, I- I'm also hearing about the Giants, right? I'm also hearing about the Giants. Also, I'm also live on uh, Facebook Live as well. I'm also live on, uh, on on the speaker app as well. If you're on the speaker app, you can hit me direct live. Chat lines is open. Um, so we got all those teams. And I'm looking at all these teams, right? Let's go down the list. Okay, Denver Broncos. If the Denver Broncos get attain Aaron Rodgers, you, you think the, the Packers aren't going to want um, Von Miller or even Nick Chubb? So you give that up. That defense is not as good as... I don't think they were that good last year. I think they were formidable, but they weren't. The, I don't think they were that good. When they, without Von Miller and Nick Chubb, huh? I don't think you got much of anything on defensively for the Denver Broncos. Are the are the Broncos better with uh? Are the Broncos better with Aaron Rodgers for sure? Are they a Super Bowl contender? Let's 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 remember this, ladies and gentlemen. The Packers were in the NFC Championship game against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Coming into the season with Aaron Rodgers, they are still a favorite to make it to the Super Bowl. One of the favorites. One of the one of the five favorites to make it to the Super Bowl with Aaron Rodgers right now. With the roster they have right now. The roster that Aaron Rodgers is so sick of because the GM got to be fired because the, his roster is so terrible, right? You really think going to the Broncos gives you a chance in the same division as Patrick Mahomes, a chance of going to the Super Bowl? Let's go to the next team. The Raiders. Another team that's in the same division as the, as the uh, as Patrick Mahomes. So you got to play Patrick Mahomes twice. Uh, we 
we we can probably pencil if Patrick Mahomes stays healthy, we can pencil in the Chiefs for double digit wins this year. Are the Raiders gonna get double digit wins with Aaron Rodgers? And what do you gotta give up? I think the Raiders' greatest asset is that tight end Waller. You take Waller off that team, what does that receiving court look like? So let's get let's get the Raiders out of here. The Miami Dolphins. Miami Dolphins played some good defense under Blind Forest right there. Under Blind Brian, Brian Forest uh, last year. I can't deny that. Um, but what do you give up to get him? What do you give up to get him? And even still, I don't think the Miami Dolphins are talented enough to even be uh, – would they be better than Buffalo if they got Aaron Rodgers today? I don't think so. Then we got Washington football team. Washington football team, who I think has the best defensive line in the NFL, um, and, and their defense isn't as bad as advertised. But um, what do you got to give up to get Aaron Rodgers? You think they're not going to want Chase Young? Hmm? What do you got to give up? To get Aaron. See, people think that Aaron Rodgers just move around, go to any team he want. The Packers are going to want a, 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 a king's ransom for a, the top one of the top five quarterbacks in the NFL. You can argue the best quarterback in the NFL right now. You can argue that. I don't even think Washington has enough assets unless the Packers want the picks, and I, they they better not be willing to give up Chase Young. This guy's this guy's crazy. He's, you want to talk about unblockable? You know, they better not be trying to give up Chase Young. Now, would they win the NFC East? Sure, he'll be the best quarterback by far in the NFC East. But is that Washington football team going to be a real contender in the NFC with Aaron Rodgers? I don't know. I don't know. I don't think Washington is that talented with Aaron Rodgers. And what you got to give up to get Aaron Rodgers? No, I don't think so. Now, here's the team that I do think that he should go to. Here's the team, here's the dark horse. Not even the dark horse, but here's the team I think is a real team. They're already formed out. They're already there. They got the players. I think they have assets to give up and to, they, they give up enough assets to get Aaron Rodgers and still be a good team. Right? And um, you know, and like they can be a contender for the uh for the Super Bowl. They'll be a top five contender for the Super Bowl. You ready for that? I think Aaron Rodgers should go to the Tennessee Titans. Hear me out. Derrick Henry's already there. You got A.J. Brown. Uh, Aaron Rodgers would turn A.J. Brown into a star. Do you hear me? A.J. Brown, A.J. Brown's already good. He's electric as a wide receiver. He would turn A.J. Brown into a star. You got Mike, uh, Mark uh, Verbal as, uh, as a coach. I like him as a coach. You got a solid to good defense. And the defense usually gets better uh, the deeper it gets into the season. They had an AFC uh, championship game run. You ship Ryan Tannehill to make the money even because Ryan Tannehill's got a contract. You ship Ryan Tannehill to the Packers. He's their new star quarterback. You ship some picks and, you know, you, 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 you spice it up. But they have some assets that can, they can give to the Packers and they can still put together a solid team going to the 2021 season and Aaron Rodgers would make that team a, a contender in the AFC. They'll be the favorite to win the AFC South. I'm not. I can't count out the. Uh, I can't count out the Indianapolis Colts with Carson Wentz. But I. I would give the Tennessee Titans with Aaron Rodgers the edge over that team. Very much so. Right. So you know, Aaron Rodgers to the Tennessee Titans would be. That would be. That would be. Uh, that would be something to see. I think Tennessee would be dangerous if they had Aaron Rodgers. Very, very dangerous if they have Aaron Rodgers. But Aaron Rodgers, stop, stop the, stop the diva stuff. Stop the diva stuff. Stop talking to, stop talking to, you know, insiders and reporters. Come out and make a statement. Say what you don't like. Say what you want. Say why you want out. You know, unless it's still like that. And the Packers, you got to be realistic. You can't keep saying you're not going to trade the guy, and the guy wants to be traded, and then don't do nothing that the guy wants to do. To keep him. That doesn't make any sense, Green Bay. So they got to figure that out. And um, you know, e even if even if even if you move on without Aaron Rodgers, if you move on without Aaron Rodgers, you got to start putting that plan together. And the book is out on the guy. There's 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 uh, the birdies are talking, the birdies are talking. The birdies are saying that the guy Jordan Love he can't play. These are Packers. There are unnamed quotes from 
uh, Green Bay Packers players saying that they've seen a guy, they've seen him in person, seen him on the field, and they said he can't play. These are Packers saying that. Green Bay Packers fans, Green Bay Packers players, anonymously, I might add, are saying he can't play. <laughs> it is what it, he can't play. That's what the pack. That's what football, other football players are saying about. It. Doesn't matter what he did in Utah. Doesn't matter what he did. You know. Doesn't matter what any fan thinks or any any hopefulness or anything like that. Doesn't matter what slot he was drafted in. There are players who've seen him play, and they said on the practice field, nonetheless, and they said he can't play. So we're going we're going to see what we're going to see what happens. We're going to see what happens. But um, Aaron Rodgers to the Tennessee Titans will be there will be an automatic contender. There will be an automatic contender overnight. Automatic contender overnight. You got Derrick Henry, arguably the best uh, running back in the league. You got a solid to okay deep. You got a solid to good defense. You got a, a, a good head coach in Mark Vrabel. You know, so that's something that, that I don't know if the Tennessee Titans are looking at that. And let's get, come on, let's stop this. This Ryan Tannehill thing. Ryan Tannehill is serviceable. Stop piping up this Ryan Tannehill stuff. If Tennessee Titans, if the, if the Tennessee Titans picked up the phone and called the Green Bay Packers and they wanted to trade and they wanted Ryan Tannehill, they would give Ryan Tannehill up in a heartbeat. They will gas the jet up right now. They'll gas up a jet right now and ship Ryan Tannehill to uh, to Wisconsin. They'll do it right now. Don't lie to me and tell me you believe in Ryan Tannehill with Aaron Rodgers on the table. Don't lie. It's a lie. There's fans in Tennessee that'll drive Ryan Tannehill to Wisconsin tonight if they had to. So it is what it is. Aaron Rodgers, stop the diva stuff, man. Um, get ready to wrap up, man. But gotta let you go. No, take care of my sponsor. Uh, please go to avalocoffee.com. Use the promo code off and get 10% off your entire coffee order. That is exclusive to my off night podcast listeners. Um, didn't get an off night radio episode in. Um, 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 over the weekend, but I got one coming this week. I got one coming this week as well. Um, a lot of stuff to get into, a lot of sp- stuff in sports to get into. Um, I just wanted to do something special for the Aaron Rodgers thing. You had to break that thing all the way down. Um, but um, yeah, I'm over and I'm out of here, man. We'll see you guys on the next episode of Off Night Radio um, on this coming weekend, man. See you guys then.